For the Garriott Engineering Design Challenge, we had to build a bridge to withstand the forces of nature. The forces of nature that it had to withstand were wind, earthquakes, and the weight of cars passing over the bridge. We used a fan to, to simulate wind going over the bridge. We, we shook the table that the bridge was on to simulate an earthquake. Then we used magnets in a bowl, putting weight on the bridge to simulate cars passing over the bridge. This bridge was built for the Gary Engineering Design Challenge. The forces of gravity, wind, earthquake vibration, and load did not affect the structure of our bridge. Our bridge was built with a certain design, which caused it to withstand forces of nature. We used trusses to even out the pressure that was created. When we placed this, tr this trusses, the strategically to counteract forces on different sections of the bridge. The towers built supported the bridge, which kept it from collapsing. There are many similarities between our bridge and the International Space Station. One of them is the flexibility. It is important to have flexibility when your with your within your bridge so the forces do not cause it to collapse. We based our project off the International Space Station and it succeeded. If we were to redesign the bridge, we'd probably make it more flexible and add trusses in better locations than they are now.